sue it. This past um, uh, while back, uh, Barbara and I were watching the movie uh, The Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm in the sci-fi. I remember the old ones, the original ones. You know, Barbara she tolerates things like that. She just says, "Okay, dear, you know, we'll go see sci-fi, and uh, then I'll go see the help with her." And uh, I, really, I really liked the help. I did. I laughed more than the help a lot. But anyway. Um, <laughs> But you know, while the movie, if you've seen the movie, and if you know San Francisco, you know they, they have the, the, uh, the forest. And uh, yeah, I just love big trees, and I just made the comment, I'd love to be there. And so for Christmas, she gives me a trip to San Francisco to go in the woods. Now, you know, you, you know, it wasn't like I said, oh, Barbara, please do that for me. No, she loves me. And she heard my desire. And, and she worked to meet that desire. When we're talking about loving God, we know he has a desire. And we are to work together to meet that desire. Working together to meet God's desire to bless the nations is what we commonly call the Great Commission. To make disciples of all nations. And our heart for God, our really our heart for the heart of God, and how we embrace that, how does it affect us? And how does pursuing that bless us further? I think it pulls everything together personally. I really do. The pursuit of making disciples of all nations, it affects everything. It affects understanding uh, more about, you know, the reason you understand your forgiveness is because you know you've got to tell, not just tell one or two people, you've got the world to tell the whole understanding of why God gives you the Holy Spirit. He empowers you to be a witness in Jerusalem, Judea, Samaria, the uttermost. It gives the whole understanding of your gifts. And let me, there, there are a lot of reasons, I, you know, the blessing of the Great Commission, when you and I really embrace it and say yes, I think it purifies our worship. I think it really does purify our worship. Imagine you are on the crew of, of a large sailboat, you know, like a, a pirate ship or 